Hello, class. Good evening. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Can you hear Hi, me? Hi, good evening. Hi. <laughs> Guys, it's good to see you. How was your day? How was Tuesday? Good? So, so? Beefy? ¿Cómo estuvo el día? How was your day? How was your day? The day was easy. It was easy, okay. Nice. Carlos, how are you? How do you feel? Hello, everyone. Hello, teacher. Um, I'm better. I feel okay. better. That's good to know. Because, um, my body, uh, me duele el cuerpo un poco todavía. Hurts. My body hurts a little. My body hurts. Pero ya mejor, gracias a Dios y gracias a ir por todo. <laughs> okay, it's good to have you in class. Okay, guys, today it's Tuesday, June 6th, 2023. It's our class number nine. Yes, guys. We, um, we uh, cover more than the... 50% of the course. Okay, so just uh, seven more classes and you will be done. Mm -hmm. It's module two. We have two lesson objectives. We You are going to learn today vocabulary related to the food pyramid and also how to express the food that you like and dislike. So the, today's topic, it's gonna be very interesting. It's one of my favorite topics, the food. And also you will learn what count and non-count nouns are. Additionally, you will learn how to use the expression, expression some and any, with count and non-count nouns. So it's very important and interesting class to day. So first we have recalling previous classes, recalling previous knowledge. Activity two, my favorite food. You will talk about your favorite food. Activity three, count and non-count nouns and wrap up. Okay, so we are going to start having the food vocabulary Okay, when we talk about food, we have a lot of categories. We have vegetables, we have fruits, we have meat or proteins, we have grains or carbohydrates, dairy products or fats, drinks, and others. So guys, right now, I want you to copy this table in your notebook and start brainstorming vocabulary for vegetables. So you copy in your notebook and you can complete with tomato, potato, fruit, bananas, apples, meat or proteins, chicken, egg, carbohydrates, rice, beans, dairy products, milk, cheese, drink, coffee, orange juice, etc. And you can write in this column other foods that are not in this group. So, and while you do this, while you do this, I'm going to take the attendance. And please remember to say present or here. I'm going to start with Alba Jocelyn Romero Lara. Alba Romero, Amalia Beatriz Tobar, present, Thank you. Ana Julia Flores, Ana Julia Flores de Cecino, not present, eh, Anderson Emanuel Palomo, Arely Janet Cornejo, Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, 
Oh, we have Fatima. Okay, Fatima. Brenda Elizabeth Dimas. Present. Thank you, Brenda. Briseida Yanel García de Crespín. Briseida Yarisa Melgar. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, Bri. Carlos Adolfo García. Present, Miss. Nice. <coughs> Carlos Manuel Velázquez. No present. Carolina Elizabeth García. Absent. Selina Yasmín Pérez. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, Selina. Cindy Fabiola Molina. Present. Thank you, Cindy. Claudia Carolina Cruz. Present. Thank you, Claudia. Cristian Josué Leiva. Present. Daniel Enrique Ayala. Daniel Quijano Gutiérrez. Edith Carolina Rivera. Eduardo Enrique Vázquez. Elsa Noelia Portillo. Present. Ok, Elsa. Erika Noemí Hueso. Present. Stephanie Araí García Ángel. Thank you, eh, Erika. Presente. Stephanie, ¿verdad? Right? Oh, it's present. Thank you. Uh, no, Christian, I could hear you. Evelyn Janet Rivera? Present. Fátima Jocelyn Portillo. Okay. Gabriel Isaac Guevara Paredes. Present. Gabriela Alexandra López. Gerardo Arturo Guzmán. Present. Jacqueline Beatriz Vigil. Ginny Lisette Escobar. Present. José Heriberto Durán. Present. Thank you, Heriberto. Okay, Jacqueline Beatriz Vigil. Okay, it's raining. Oh, well, it's not raining here where I live, but I'm sorry if it's raining there where you live. Okay, so we have the vegetables, fruit, meat, grains, dairy products, drinks, and others. Oops, sorry. <laughs> so, guys. We are going to complete with vocabulary and you're going to help me. Okay, what did you write in vegetable? Eggplant. Oh, eggplant. What else? Carrots. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Broccoli. Carrots. Potatoes. Eh, Onion. Onions. Cucumber. Cucumber. Yeah. Ginger. Oh. Onion. Onions. Garlic. Corn. Also lettuce, tomatoes. tomatoes and lettuce to make a salad. <laughs> okay, what about fruit? I know you have more and it's, it's okay. Apple, bananas. Excuse me? Bananas. 
Peach, like the princess. Apples. Yes, apples. Grapes. Grapes. Watermelon. Watermelon. I was thinking about watermelon. Pineapple. 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 Yes. Yeah. And we have more like papayas, guayabas, and mangoes, and blueberries. Mm -hmm. Orange, tangerine. Right? tangerine, right? We have a lot of fruits. Now, meat or protein? Fish. Fish, yes, delicious. Meat. Eggs. Meat. Turkey. Eggs. 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 Yeah, beef. Pork. Do you like pork? Do you eat Beans. pork? I like pork. <laughs> yeah, I like pork ribs. Mm -hmm. As, As Gabriel said, ribs. Beans. Oh, they could be proteins, right? But we are going to put it here in grain. No, okay. grains, carbohydrates, beans. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they could be carbohydrates or proteins. Rice. Okay, in grains we have rice. Just just Bacon. one more in meat or proteins. I would write shrimps because Bacon. I love shrimps. Do you like shrimps? Right. The shrimps? Yes. Yes. Do you like shrimp cocktail? Right. <clears throat> Camarón? Shrimp. Shrimp. Do you like shrimp cocktail? I yes, like. Okay, we have grains and carbohydrates, beans, rice. What else? Rice. Cereals. Yes. Cereals. Cereals. Yeah. Crackers. Okay. Rice. Rice is there. Beans and rice. Cereal crackers. Meat. Yeah. Wheat. Uh -huh. Wheat. Bread. Bread. Yes. Bread. Yes. Tortilla. Right? Tortillas. Tortillas. And also carbohydrates. Well, all what is from corn. Corn. Mm. Flour. Noodles. Noodles, oh, spaghetti, uh -huh. yeah. noodles, all the pasta, oh. spaghetti, yeah. mm. yeah. mm. yeah. yeah. mm. yeah. what yeah. about dairy products or fat? Yogurt. <laughs> yogurt. I like yogurt. It's delicious. Milk. Oh, yeah, definitely milk. Cream. Cheese. My cheese. husband, my husband can't live without cream. <laughs> cheese. Butter. 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 Uh, butter. Oil. Okay, oil. <laughs> oil like masola, orisol, oil. Oil. Right. Mm. And, uh, yeah. Ice cream? Ice cream, yeah. Juice orange? Oh, yeah. that is in drinks. Cookies? Ah, okay. Sí. Drinks, juice. Lemon. Lemonade. Soda. <laughs> Soda, yeah. Coffee. Mm -hmm. Yes, the elixir of life. Coffee. I need a coffee right now. Tea. 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 Yes, it's good. 
Like, you know what? I eat. No, I drank a milkshake for the evening. Okay. For the shake. Fine. I drank milkshake for the evening for the dinner, what? and it makes me so sleepy. <laughs> The meal makes me so sleepy. Okay, what about this one? The Pilsener, the Modelo, and all of those beers, right? Beers. Tigre. Excuse me, Daniel? Tigre. The verde. Oh, green tea. Ah, green tea. Water? Water. Green tea. Yes. Chocolate. Hot chocolate. Yeah, or cocoa, right? Okay, what about others? In others, we can have, for example, ketchup. Donuts. Donuts, <laughs> carbohydrates, right? Mayonnaise. Mayonnaise. And, and salad. 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 Mexico. Mexican food. Hey, okay, <laughs> Mexican food. Type of food. Sandwiches. Pupusas. Sandwiches. Pupusas, delicious. So. Oh, salt, sugar. That's important too. And some spices. But no, okay. Cinnamon, for example, that I, I like cinnamon in dessert or in some food, right? Pepper. The Oh, pepper. Pepper. Or peppermint. Pepper. Okay, we have a lot of vocabulary about food. Excellent. Very nice. I love this. Okay, now we'll go over the next slide. In the next slide, we have my favorite food. Um, I have here, I have prepared some questions and examples. Mm -hmm. uh, the question is, what do you usually, usually, it's like 90% of the time, what do you usually have for breakfast? Uh, who would like to read the example? Who would like to read the example? I usually have eggs, beans, shares, or cream. Christian? Uh, no. What do you usually have for breakfast? I usually have eggs, beans, cheese, or cream, and coffee. I always have coffee in the morning. Yeah, continue. Please. Sometimes I have pupusas. I also eat a base of food. Excellent. What do you usually have for breakfast? Very nice. And we say, well, I usually have a typical breakfast, like eggs, beans, so cheese, and coffee. Mm -hmm. And you are using the adverse of frequency. I always have coffee in the morning. Yeah, I I can't I can start my day without coffee. <laughs> but sometimes I have pupusas or I also eat a piece of fruit. That is for breakfast. Now the other question is what do you like eating for lunch? What do you like eating for lunch? For lunch, I like chicken food with vegetables and tortillas or tacos because I love tacos. Okay, that's an example. And the last question, what do you usually eat for dinner? I usually eat beans, plantain, tortilla or bread and avocado and coffee again. <laughs> That's just an example, or you can say and tea or milk or chocolate, etc. What do you never eat in the evening? I never eat fish or seafood in the evening. Okay, what is something you never, never, right? I never eat fish soup, for example. 
<laughs> I think it's not good for my stomach in the evening. So guys, you are going to go to breakout rooms and you are going to practice these questions. I have another question here. Oh, no, but, not, but later. So right now, I want you to practice these questions. I'm going to send you the examples in the WhatsApp group, but right now I would like to um, go and join the breakout rooms, okay? In the rooms with your group, you are going to practice. Uh, what do you eat? What do you eat for different times of the day? Stephanie, Jacqueline, Cindy, Briseida, and Erica. Beings. Beans and cream, cream and bread. Cream and bread. Yes. And you, uh, Edith Carolina. I usually have beans and cream and coffee. Always I coffee in the morning. I don't listen. Okay. Repeat, so, please. I usually have. Me escucha? Repeat, please. Okay. I usually have beans. Uh -huh, beans. Egg. Egg. Uh -huh. Almuerzo. Almuerzo. Uh -huh. What do you like for lunch? I for like lunch? Um, rice, yeah. chicken, uh, pies of cheese, uh, some tomatoes, and tortillas. Ah, um, a juice of no, a Coca Cola. <laughs> Usually. Usually. I love Coca-Cola. Lo que le va a arruinar los huesos. <laughs> a liter, a liter. A liter Coca-Cola. <laughs> Hello, Claudia, Fatima, and Christian. Hello. Did you finish the practice? No. No. Okay. Continue. <laughs> Pregunta Cristian o pregunto yo. Eh, Empieza usted. Preguntando.
¿Le pregunto? ¿O pregunta usted? Pregúnteme usted primero. Okay. What do you what do you usually have for breakfast? I usually have eggs, beans, and cream, and, and bread, and coffee. And no coffee. Uh, tortillas or bread. And sometimes eat pupusas for dinner. And drink chocolate. Okay. And you? Um, usually it's uh, <coughs> tortillas, um, beans, um, coffee or white. Ay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> What do you usually have for breakfast? For breakfast. Breakfast. I usually breakfast. I love the process. And hot. I guess in, in, in breakfast every day, I, I drink coffee and, and, and the cheesecake. And sometimes I use use uh, orange and, and only uh, for for uh, I usually um eat hello hola. Hi. Sí. Okay. What do you usually eat for breakfast? I usually eat chicken soup and tortilla. What do you usually eat for dinner? I dinner I um Te, te chai, e bread. Bread. Te, yes. Okay. Amalia, you can say, I usually have, I usually have chai tea. I usually have tea. And a piece of bread. A piece of bread. Okay. Piece of bread. A piece. A piece. Of bread. Bread. Okay. A piece of bread. Mm. Oh, yes. A piece shape. Okay. Bread. And bread. Okay. what do you never eat in the evening? Ne, ne, I never. Because I know, no. Usually eating, no. What? Oh, excuse me? No. Am Usually, I... uh, the... what do you never eat in the evening? Is the question. Mm -hmm. mm, is meat? Meat, no. Okay. Okay, Amalia, you say, I never eat meat. Meat. I never eat meat. Excellent. Okay, people, it was good to see you talking, speaking English, talking about food. <laughs> okay, thank you. Thank you very much for practicing. Remember that practice, practice, and practice makes perfect. Okay, so it's important to speak, right? 
This is the opportunity you have to socialize and speak English with your classmates. So I love that you were talking with them. I have just a couple of questions and volunteers can raise your hand and share with the class. For example, somebody would like to share with the class what you usually eat for breakfast. Because of time, we are going to listen only one volunteer per question. Only one volunteer. Thank you, Carlos Garcia. Hello? Yes. Okay. Okay. El micrófono lo tenía, no, no cambiaba, perdón. No. Um, um I usually I usually have in my breakfast beans, eggs, um cheese, plantain, um ketchup. Really? For your for the egg? Yes. For the eggs ketchup. And um how do you say chile? Hot pepper. Hot peppers. <laughs> Pero jalapeño. Uh, hot chili pepper. Chile. Okay. And coffee. Wow. And coffee. I, I like two cups, two cups of coffee. Two, two cups. cups of coffee. Yes. Wow. Yes. That's a lot. And a piece of sweet beans. <laughs> yes. Candies. Yes. Candy. Wow, you need a lot of sugar. <laughs> Hello. Wow, Carlos, thank you. Well, um, I need another person to tell me what do you like eating for lunch? Let's see, Edith Carolina. Um, for lunch, I usually I stop with vegetable and chicken and tortillas. Um, drink. Okay, so you usually have chicken soup with vegetables. And some more. Sorry, guys, I had a problem with the internet connection. But Edith, you were telling me that you like eating chicken soup with vegetables and, tor and three tortillas. Que no tengo anything. Pero que solo la teacher está teniendo problemas. Hi, I'm sorry, guys. Hi. Because of the internet Hi, failures. But I remember Edith was talking. She eats soup with vegetables and three tortillas. Yes, teacher. Wow, Edith, that's a lot. I only eat one. <laughs> 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 but it's okay. With soup, it's okay. Thank you, Edith, for sharing. Now, I would like another person to tell me, what do you usually eat for dinner? <coughs> Hello? 
Gabriel, please. Yes. Uh, I usually eat for dinner beans, cream, eggs, uh, cheese, and and juice. Very nice. Thank you, Gabriel. And okay. guys, what do you never eat in the evening? I never eat fish or seafood is correct for me. Okay. Amalia said that she never eats meat in the evening. Me too. Meat, meat. Oh, I know Elia too. Okay. <laughs> nice. Do you drink coffee in the evening? Sometimes. Yes. Sometimes, because some people, uh, some people don't drink coffee in the evening. I never drink coffee in the evening. You never? No, because, because <laughs> live with the, 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 the sleeping. You, the can't sleep. sleep, you can't sleep if you drink coffee. <laughs> yes. Yeah, some people have that problem. Yes. Okay, thank you so much for your participation. Now we are going to learn about the food that we like and we don't like. Tell me, people, what food don't you like? Well, I don't like sushi. I don't like guayaba. I don't like beers and wine. I don't know, but I don't like them. And I don't like rabbit. Poor animal. Can you tell me the food you don't like? Volunteers? Adolfo? Carlos? Thank you. I don't like the flor de sote. I don't like the, how do you say, chufles. Oh, um, yes. The chufles flower. Like... Yes, yes. Okay. Ay, sí, son ricos. <laughs> They are I delicious. Don't, I don't like paqueros. You don't like oh, paqueros. No son salvadoreños. But say it in English, Edith. <laughs> yes. You know I'm what? Today, <laughs> today I had isote flour for dinner. Ay, teacher. I don't like, eh, eh, ¿cómo se llama esa cosa? Amarga, ¿cómo se llama? Pacaya. Esa pacaya. I don't like, I don't like pacaya. pacaya. Okay. I don't like white beans. Okay, you don't like beans or white beans? White beans. White. I don't like. I love white beans. <laughs> Okay, but we all have different different likes, right? We have different likes. Now let's talk about the food. Oh, and I don't like shells cocktail. The shells cocktail. I don't like it. Do you like it? What is shells? What is the meaning of <clears throat> shell cocktail? Shells cocktail. The little animal, well, the Shifu. shells like the house, right? Conch. Yes, concha, shells. Oh, no, 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 I don't like. <laughs> uh, you don't like shells. Okay. I no. like the camarones. Cheese con like shrimp. camarones. <laughs> okay, Arely, you like shrimp. You like shrimp. I mm. like shrimps, but I don't like shells. But I like shrimp. Now let's talk about the food that you like. What food do you like? Look at this little girl. What does she like? Wow. I like pupusas. I like pupusas. <laughs> and coffee. Yes, like pupusas, tacos, meat, roasted chicken, carrots, bananas, strawberry, mangoes, arrayanes. Yes, arrayanes. Okay, what's your favorite fruit? My favorite fruit is mango. 
mango. Me too. Nice. So bananas. Bananas, yes. In my yeah, the fruit is melon. Melon. The fruit is leeches. <laughs> oh, leeches. Okay. And what's your favorite drink? Beers. Beers. My favorite drink is coffee. Coffee. I <laughs> like coffee. <laughs> no, I like coffee. I like coffee. <laughs> you like coffee. I think Carlos likes cola. Coffee. Oh. I coffee. like lemonade. Lemonade. Lemonade is delicious. Yeah. Especially with mint. With mint leaves. Comenta. With leaves. With mint is delicious. My favorite drink is chocolate. Chocolate. Hot chocolate. Yes. With milk or no milk? Hello, for me. Milk? Do you like hot chocolate with milk? Yes, for milk. Yeah, my husband loves it too. Okay. okay. My favorite drink is uh, chocolate. 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 So you eat pupusas chocolate. and you drink chocolate. Yes. Nice, nice. Okay, and what's your favorite vegetable? Broccoli. Nice, broccoli is, is good for you. I love carrots and onions. Uh -huh. I like tomatoes. Oh, yes, tomatoes. Yeah. And in my case, I like potato. Oh, yes, potatoes. <laughs> All the children love potatoes. All the children love potatoes. Okay, very nice. Thank you. Very good. So now, guys, we are going to learn about count and non-count nouns. So the count nouns or countable nouns are the ones that can be singular or plural. For example, an apple, some apples. We can count them. We can count them with our fingers. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay? And uncountable nouns, <clears throat> we cannot count them. They are not plural. They are always singular. All the liquids, are uncountable nouns. For example, coffee, meal, water, orange juice, etc. But we also have some other things like money, like money and pasta, rice, sugar, salt, flour. Those are uncountable. We don't say coffee. We don't say 100 rices or 30 beans. We cannot count them, right? So they are always singular because we cannot count every sugar or, or every rice, right? It's not possible. So that's why they are uncountable. They will always be singular. Okay, now there are some words that we use with countable and uncountable nouns. Okay, here we have more examples. Countables, we have buns, sandwich, because we can say sandwiches, apple, apples, orange, oranges, burger, burgers, fries, eggs, salad, vegetables, cookies, potatoes, tomato, carrot, hot dog, candy, olive, peanuts, pancakes, onions, watermelon, pea, grapes, and cherries. So these are countable. We can say a burger and five burgers. We can say one egg, 10 eggs. We can say one tomato and we can say 25 tomatoes for $1. Nah, nah that's not possible anymore. 
Okay, <clears throat> so they can be countables, or they are countable, singular and plural. But we have some uncountables now. In English, the bread is uncountable because they don't have pan francés, right? Here we can count the bonds of bread, but American people, they just have the bread and the loaf of bread and also the slices of bread, but they are uncountable. We have fruit in general, <clears throat> It's uncountable. Juice, meat, rice, cereal, jam, milk, coffee, sugar, flour, <clears throat> oil, salt, soup, tea, cottage, cheese, pasta, honey, water, cheese, butter, seafood, and mustard. So all of that are uncountable. <clears throat> There are some uh, more examples here, not only food, but only but also other things. For example, non-count nouns we have with food, bread, butter, cheese, chicken, fish, flour, and pepper. The chicken, but not the animal. I mean, the animal, but in as food, as food is uncountable. Okay. <clears throat> the same with the fish as food is uncountable. All the liquids like coffee, juice, meal, soda, tea. This is water, no waste. This is water. Subjects are non-count nouns. Chemistry, English, history, math, music. <clears throat> Abstract ideas like anger, beauty, humor, justice, knowledge, love, and luck. And others like furniture, homework, guys. Homework is never plural. Homework is singular and is non count now. So you don't say, I have three homeworks. That's incorrect. You say, I have homework. I have a lot of homework. Information, money, and software are non count now. Now, <clears throat> here we can see the, the expression some and any, and how we can use it with count and non-count nouns. For example, <clears throat> do we need any eggs? Yes, let's get some eggs. No, we don't. No, we don't need any. Or we don't need any eggs. So we use any questions and negative. Questions and negative, I use any. And some is used in affirmative statements. Okay? We have here a specific. I'm eating an egg. Let's get some bread. Because bread is... Non-count noun. We can use some with count and non-count nouns. Do we need any bread? Yes, let's get some bread. No, we don't need any bread. Okay, in this case, the non-count nouns are bread and lemonade. General, eggs are good for you. Bread is good for you. Why? Because eggs can be singular or plural because they are count nouns. So in general, we say X are good for you. But with the non-count nouns, we say like this, bread is good for you. Let's look at the next graphic. Maybe it's gonna help you a little bit more. <clears throat> so remember, we can use some and any with both. But some is only used in affirmative sentences. Some is always in affirmative. Any is used only in negative and questions. Okay? Only in negative and questions. For example, I ask you, 
Do you have any questions? Do you have any questions? I'm using any in a question, right? <clears throat> Do you have any questions, guys? It's Ria. No? Yes, maybe. No, I don't. Any questions? No, it's clear. Okay, clear, nice. Now look at this example with there is and there are. And remember that we use a or an only with countables in singular. There is a plum, there is an apple, there is an orange juice, there is a dog, there is a computer. Some is used with countables and uncountables, both, but only in affirmative sentences. Example, there is some sugar, there are some apples. And any is used with countables and uncountables, but the difference is that we only use it in negative and in interrogative sentences or questions. Example, there isn't any sugar, there aren't any apples. Is there any sugar? Are there any apples? Okay, is it clear, guys? The difference between a or an, some, and any? Yes? No? Maybe? Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so right now, guys, <clears throat> I would like to give me some examples using there is and there are some and any in the chat, okay? You would write it, you can tell me about what's there in your refrigerator. What's there in your refrigerator or in your kitchen? For example, in, me, in my refrigerator, there are some tomatoes, onions, and potatoes. There is some cheese. But there isn't, there isn't any broccoli. There isn't any soup. There are only two tortillas in my refrigerator. So, uh -huh. so what's there in your refrigerator? Tell me, what's that in your refrigerator? I'm waiting for the answers in the chat. Okay, let's see. Gabriel says in my refrigerator there Okay, Gabriel, you were just missing R. There are grapes, apples, yogurts, and candies. In my refrigerator, there are grapes. Apples, yogurts, and candies. There are apples. Okay, if you say apples in plural, Carlos Garcia, you don't use an. An is only in singular. There are apples. There is a watermelon. There are some strawberries and tomatoes and some potatoes. 
in my refrigerator. <laughs> okay, Edith. Water is singular or plural, Edith? Edith. Singular. It's singular, yes. In my, ref in my refrigerator, there is some water. Okay. <clears throat> okay, more examples. There are some eggs, potatoes, tomatoes, onions. There are some tortillas. There isn't any coffee. There isn't any hot chocolate. Uh, in my refrigerator, there are some carrots, tomatoes, apples, broccoli, cheese, cream, and tortillas. Gabriel, in my refrigerator, there aren't any water and soda. Very good. Very nice. <laughs> in my refrigerator, there aren't... Okay. Gabriel Isaac sería in my refrigerator there isn't there isn't any water and soda because water and soda are non canals so it's in singular. Uh, River, in my refrigerator there are watermelons but there aren't any bananas. Excellent. There is some chicharrones. Oh, cheese, butter, beans, chicken, milk. <laughs> there are some tomatoes, some carrots. Cheese, tortillas, there is some water, and there isn't any onions and any potatoes. Okay, in este caso, Jenny, sería there aren't any onions and any potatoes. Remember, singular and plural. Singular and plural. Be careful with the singulars and the plural forms. Uh, there are some tomatoes, some potatoes, some eggs, some yogurt, some avocado. Mm, nice. Okay, people, it's nine o'clock. Thank you so much for connecting to the class. I hope this class is it, it can be useful for the exercises in the platform. Remember, section four and part of section five. So please do it because it's very, very important so that you can continue with the English class the next module. Okay. Thank you so much and have a good good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.